When basic troubleshooting doesn't resolve the sound issue, we need to isolate whether the problem is with the monitor's internal speakers or the audio signal itself. Connect headphones to the monitor's audio output. If you hear sound through the headphones, but not the built-in speakers, this confirms the monitor is receiving audio, but the internal speakers are faulty. If the headphone test shows no audio signal reaching the monitor, try restarting both your computer and monitor. This simple step can resolve many audio driver and connection issues. A common mistake is connecting cables to the wrong audio port. Make sure you're connecting your computer's audio to the monitor's audio in port, not the audio out port. Some Acer monitor models have specific limitations. The ED320QR may not have built-in speakers at all. The CB272 might ignore the audio input jack when using HDMI, working better with VGA connections instead. If all troubleshooting steps fail, the monitor's internal speakers may be malfunctioning. At this point, contacting Acer support is recommended for hardware diagnosis and potential warranty service. Remember that larger monitors generally have louder speakers due to more space for audio components. If your monitor is small and the speakers seem quiet, this may be normal behavior rather than a malfunction.